The New York congressman once claimed Andrew and Trader's company was his client. Another in Trader company allegedly made a deposit with a firm where Santos worked. The death toll from a Russian missile strike in the Ukrainian city of Dnipro rose to 40 on Monday with dozens more missing, making it the deadliest civilian incident of Moscow's three-month campaign of hurling missiles at cities far from the front. Searchers found both the cockpit voice recorder and flight data recorder on Monday from a passenger flight that crashed killing at least 68 people in Nepal's worst plane accident in 30 years, officials said. Shares firmed on Monday as optimism over corporate earnings in China's reopening offset concerns the Bank of Japan BOJ, might temper its supersized stimulus policy at a pivotal meeting this week, while a holiday in U.S. markets made for thin trading. Matteo Messina Denaro, one of the bosses of the Cosa Nostra Mafia in Sicily and Italy's most wanted man, has been arrested by police while being treated in a private health clinic in Palermo, prosecutor Maurizio De Lucia said Monday. Another atmospheric river has arrived in storm-battered California, bringing renewed flooding fears, possible landslides and treacherous travel to the state Monday where a relentless string of storms has already delivered widespread damage and left at least one.